Hey guys, what's up? I am back with another video, and today I'm going to be carving this cute, tiny, little pumpkin. Look how tiny it is. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to be carving that, and then you guys can watch me, and I'm going to be showing you what you guys need. Okay, so first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to take your mat and put it out like that. Next, you're going to take your pumpkin, place it on there, and take out your knife. Okay, so first thing that you're going to do is you're going to want to cut out the top. Make sure to subscribe if you guys want to win a $20, $25 gift card. It's legit. It, the raffle is going to be ending by uh, um, November 25th. So... Subscribe if you want to win. And like, two more cuts. And we are there. Ready? Let's pull it out. Boom. It's so tiny. Look at it. Okay. Next thing that you want to do is you're going to want to cut off where the orange meets the yellow. So you only have that. Because you're going to need to put a candle in there. You don't want that interfering with the candle. Make sure that this still fits fits okay wipe off your knife so it doesn't get corroded then you're gonna want to put this in your tiny bowl okay next is the carving process so to do this you're gonna want your tiny spoon and your tiny bowl I think this is so cute but you're gonna want to start curving out the insides like so The least thing I would, I thought this was just going to be completely pumpkin on the inside, but it's not. So you're going to, let me get this in the camera view. So what you're going to want to do is when you do this, you want to do it like a twisting action to get it out. That's how I do it. I think it's just easy. Easiest. But the hardest thing that you can do is the eyes. That's the hardest part. And I'll be back when this is done. Next, you're going to want to go clean this out. So you're going to clean this out and your rag. Boop. Okay, next is the hardest part, which is the face. So basically, the way you want to do it is start by making tiny little incisions, like a triangle or whatever shape you want. My favorite is triangle. And this is what the finished product will look like. So what I did is I just went zigzag and then cut it out like that, like that. And then I just cut tiny little ridges in the bottom. You can see kind of like teeth are going like that. And next is the candle.